Hey there friends, Susan here with Pumpkin Hill Stampers. We have sketch number 87 to share today. So we're going to be creating with the bright and beautiful DSP. I've got this blue panel here, which I've used before, you can see, and I'm pairing it with blueberry bushel and azure afternoon. So this is gonna be a monochromatic card. Now the first one, I'm gonna cut down to a quarter sheet. So it's five and a half by four and a quarter. And the second one is stepped in. So it is eight by five and a quarter. Next, we're going to die cut a circle out of that scrap DSP. Then I fold it in half, give it a good crease, and use my paper snips to cut it in half for two half circles. Next, I stamped the Big Bloom from the new Simply Zillia, Zinnia, sorry, Simply Zinnia stamp set and used my blueberry bushel ink. Then I used my blender pen to kind of wash out that color and fill in those blooms. Then I used my Granny Apple Breed Blend Marker and put some coloring into the stems and leaves. Use your paper snips to give it a good trim out around the edges. Then I'm gonna go ahead and stamp the sentiment with my blueberry bushel as well. Then I'm going to use my paper snips to trim that out as an element. So these are all the parts and pieces we're gonna use on our project for today. And yes, all the details are on the mini tutorial. So don't worry about that. You'll be getting them in your email if you have subscribed. So start by folding your base in half. This is the stepped in base. Then I decided to do some dry embossing with the basics embossing folder. Then that gets mounted onto the quarter sheet cardstock. Just step that in with your liquid adhesive. Next, we're gonna add the two half circles with our liquid adhesive. I put one on the top offset to the right and the other offset on the bottom to the left. Then we're going to add our Zinnia Blooms. Now I'm just using basic you know, liquid adhesive to put these on so it doesn't get too thick. Next we're going to use dimensionals to pop that sentiment down below and I've tacked it right along the top of that lower half circle. To dress it up just a little bit I use Parakeet Party in color pearls, one on the top and one on the bottom. So there is our simple sketch. It's got some parts and pieces. You need to do some coloring and trimming, but it's all fun and that's what Stampin' Cards is all about. So leave me a comment, let me know what you think. Remember you can subscribe so you don't miss out on more and you can always find me at my website or email me with the link below. All right guys, go do some fun stamping.